Hey, it's the Farm Girl Chef here, and today I'm gonna show you how to make an oatmeal bake. But what I love about this recipe is that it's packed with fiber. Not only do we have fiber from our rolled oats, but we have fiber from our Trina homegrown futons. Today I'm gonna to use the All American Blend, which has tons of sun-dried fruit. And so I'm gonna show you how to get started. First things first, we're going to put some rolled oats into a bowl, sweeten it with some brown sugar, then we're gonna add a pinch of salt, chopped walnuts. You could interchange these for other nuts. And then for our flavorings, we're gonna add about a teaspoon of vanilla extract. And one and two thirds cup of milk. Okay? And the last few things to go in here, it's gonna be one egg, just one whole egg. And then we have our fruitons. Now, today I'm using the Trina Homegrown All-American Blend. It has peaches, cranberries, grapes, apples, blueberries, tons of good stuff in there. You know what, I'm just gonna dump what's left in the bag there. So this is all the ingredients. We're gonna stir it together till it's all combined. Once our base is combined, I'm gonna put it into an eight by eight baking dish. You wanna grease this either with olive oil, coconut oil, or butter, and everything's gonna go in. To make the crumb topping for our oatmeal, I have two tablespoons of melted butter here, some brown sugar. I like brown sugar because it gives that caramelized note. Flour, salt, and a little bit of cinnamon. And then I'm just gonna stir this together. What the heck, we'll just add some more fruitons in there too. We don't get enough fruit in our diet anymore and so I like to add these fruitons to anything that I can because I'm really big about getting all that needed fruit and nutrients into our body. I'm just gonna drop this topping in little drops all over the oats. And then this will bake in a 350 degree oven for about 50 minutes. All right, it's ready for the oven. 50 minutes later, our oatmeal bake is completely cooked. You can see it's got golden brown around the edges. To serve this up, I like to scoop it out using a little spatula. And then I top it with a dollop of Greek yogurt and then more croutons. That looks pretty good if I don't say so myself. Thanks for joining me, the Farm Girl Chef Elizabeth and Trina Homegrown to make this oatmeal bake. This needs to be added to your meal prep because it is delicious, packed with fiber. We're adding tons of fruit to our diet and no added sugar in the sun-dried fruit. Give it a try today.